Whoa, it's the illusion reporting from somewhere on Spaceship Earth. I was in my room napping, and I got a call from a cat named Saul, and he's buying, looking at you, looking at me, looking at you, and I'm going to meet him right now. And of course, I'm going to take him a couple complimentary stickers. So trippy how it all works. You just never know what's what's gonna happen, man. It's kind of a uh, kind of a mind boggler sometimes. Super stoked about it though, man. Kind of fired up to meet this cat. You know how random is this? I'm gonna put his put his picture in a plastic bag because it's raining out, man. I don't want it to get wet because. Uh, the illusion, hand delivering, man. It's pretty hot, pretty random, pretty cool, pretty stoked about it. I hope this kid's stoked. Anyway, I'm off to meet this cat. Maybe, maybe he'll want to meet you. I don't know how these things work. We're just, uh, we're just in the now. He fired up about this little rendezvous. <laughs> yeah, the encounter with the painting was truly epic. It was a high school principal who watches The Illusion, was stoked to buy some art for his wife. Pretty fired up about it. We had a really cool conversation, talked about a lot of stuff. He drove up from Orange County to pick up the painting. Orange County is probably an hour if all's going well, but with traffic, dude, who knows, man. Like a high school principal bought a painting from the illusion. And the funny thing I was thinking about it driving over here to Michael's because I'm gonna buy more art supplies and make more was that it was the first time I've ever talked to a high school principal where I didn't feel awkward. We had a really nice conversation, high frequency all the way. Actually, I'm just really super pumped about the whole, this whole thing. Like, it just goes to show, it just, you just never know what's going on. You just have to let it out of your heart. Just let it out of your heart, be positive, and really cool things begin to happen. I'm going to buy some pens.